If I traded it all, if I gave it So welcome back. I am very excited about having my next guest on. I have with me Stephen Acuff, and uh, he is a food and health coach since 1979. He's lectured in 27 countries. He's, his first book was written in German about food for health that has sold nine editions, uh, but his new book, which I'm really excited about having him, it's in English, everybody, the new book, and it is called Eating the Woo, Eating the Woo Way, uh, which is going to be interesting to hear about, uh, for a longer, healthier life. You worked for several years as a nutrition consultant at a medical cl uh, clinic in Kassel, Germany, with a large oncology cancer department. Um, you've helped a lot of people for years get healthy, it sounds like. Tell us a little bit about yourself and, and the book, and you've got something really exciting happening this weekend, so I want to talk a little bit about that, too. So, welcome to the show. Well, thank you very much. Uh, it's the second time I've been to Phoenix. I was here 20 years ago, and I just love the city. I do travel around a lot. Um, I spend half the year living in Europe, a lot of time in uh, Germany and Scandinavia, and then half the year in Australia. Okay, and, and you've written this book in English for us. Tell us what it means, eating the Wu Wei. Well, Wu Wei is actually a term from Taoism, and it means not doing or without effort. So it's the basic concept of Taoism, which is a philosophy of life that has existed for 5,000 years. And it means that we should not resist nature, but go with the flow of nature. So it's learning how to eat uh, according to our natural needs. In other words, it's improving our intuitive ability to perceive what we need. Okay. Now, we're going to be giving away one of the books. We're going to enter everybody into win one book. And also, you've got an event coming up this weekend at the Tudor Plaza in Phoenix. Tell us what's going to happen there. I'm going to do uh, uh, the uh, art of oriental and facial health evaluation of looking at ourselves and seeing how we uh, how we're doing basically not waiting until you've got symptoms and hurting uh, it's partly based on the traditional Chinese uh, form which is energetic and then the German naturopathic method which is uh, very interesting as a complement to the Chinese. Well we're going to open up our lines to the audience and everyone gets a call and throughout the rest of the show for all these things. Uh, first of all you're going to get entered in to win a book along with we're going to also give away a ticket for the event. That's a hundred dollar value. The event is at the Tudor Plaza in Phoenix. It's Saturday 10 to 5 and it's Sunday 1230 to uh, sorry 1230 to 6 p.m. There's going to be a specialty lunch <laughs> also involved with that. I'm sure it's going to be a woo, woo lunch, right? That's right. And again, we're going to open up the lines to the audience here. Our number here is 602-277-5369 and toll free it's 1-866-536-1100. So, but you're an American but live abroad. That's right. Well, so where do you come from? I'm from the state of Oregon originally, and um, I've just come from there, and so it's nice to have some sun after a week of rain and clouds. So why did you come here? Did you come here for this event? Yes, I did. Uh, I'm actually traveling from Europe to uh, Australia, and this is a stopover. So what's your education in helping people eating healthy? <clears throat> well, I began just by my own uh, interest in uh, healthy food. And what has always bothered me is that there is such conflicting scientific information that we have to go beyond scientific information because it changes all the time. Two years ago, the American Authority for uh, Dietary Advice uh, told us that uh, cholesterol is no longer an issue after 40 years of telling us to eat cholesterol. Uh, Don't low. they do that all the time? That's right, they do. And so, uh, you know, and peop the most common question I get is, who are you supposed to believe? Everybody's saying something different and it changes all the time. And I say, well, don't believe anyone. You have to really refine your own ability to feel what's right, but you do need some knowledge to get into that. So I show people how to develop their more intuitive feeling. And uh, I haven't seen a doctor in 45 years, so I think that uh, I figured it out. Wow, that's awesome. Now, let's talk about what you're going to talk about at the seminar. Okay, I'm going to talk about the how we look at ourselves and at others and see signs of imbalance so that we can correct those problems and not wait until the symptoms are there. So as a sign, for one sign, what would be the top sign that somebody would have an imbalance? Well, the most the, the face is always the easiest to see because everyone shows his face. And uh, what you'll see is bags under the eyes, which are often a sign of kidney problems. But you see... Um, uh, uh, a very deep crease going from the nose down to the corner of the mouth, which with swelling on the outside is very typical of pancreatic weakness, which is 
rampant today, pancreatic problems. We've, got, we've had a four-fold increase in diabetes in the last 26 years, four times as much diabetes, imagine. Uh, the CDC, Con Center for Disease Control, says that uh, in the year 2050, between one-third and one-half of Americans will be diabetic. Now, just imagine what that means, and you can see it on the faces. You just look at this, this swelling that goes on the outside. Uh, on the lips will also show uh, imbalance in the uh, digestive system. And um, uh, between the eyes, you can see also liver signs, so you get a good picture of what's going on. Now, Eating the Wu Wei, which is this book that we're going to be giving away along with the ticket, it's a $100 value free to you guys out there for this weekend. Our number here is 602-277-5369, and toll free it's 1-866-536-1100. The Eating the Wu Wei for a Longer, Healthier Life. It also has recipes. Yay! Uh, let's talk a little bit about you know the Wu Wei. And because it's a long book, it's not a short book. That's so right. let's talk about how all the things in it so we can get them interested in the book. Go ahead. Okay. Uh, a basic uh, food is uh, whole grains, especially brown rice, uh, oats. Uh, there's a lot of people talking against grains these days, but if we use grains properly in connection with, with the right amount of fat and protein, grains are still good food. Uh, uh, there's something like a, a fear almost of grains, uh, but uh, it's exaggerated. Then there's a lot of vegetables, which everyone agrees on is good, but this is a milk-free program. We recommend not to have any dairy food because of its effect on the lymph system, which is a blocking effect. So all dairy completely out? All dairy completely out. Uh, that's a recommendation, you know. Uh -huh. The less, the better, we could say. Right. Uh, then uh, having plant protein. A lot of the problems today are because of over-acidity. The body has too much acid. And uh, if we eat animal protein at every meal, which is what people do, even cheese is animal protein, then the body cannot deal well with that, and we get uh, excesses of acid gathering in the connective tissue. This uh, slows down the lymph system and is the basis for illness. So let me ask you something. Uh would you suggest people to go organic, or is it eating off? I mean, what do you mean by, well, should we just be eating leaves? What should we eat? Well, I'll give and, you a, and wheat. I'll give you an example of a meal that I might have. I have uh, uh, pulses or uh, legumes like lentils, chickpeas, beans as protein, although I, I'm not vegetarian. I do eat animal protein, too, but that's more of a secondary or supplementary food. And what we need is just more of the plant-based protein. I'll have brown rice, which I love, uh, or some other kind of grain as possible, but I, I do tend to brown rice. Uh, then vegetables, uh, baked vegetables, like baked pumpkin, squash, uh, broccoli, I mean, any kind of vegetables, but also pickled vegetables. And you get those in the organic food sh shops. So uh, I, I, I'm always for organic when you can get it, but it's not always available, but right. as much as possible. Right. Now, again, this Saturday from 10 to 5, Sunday, 1230 to 6 p.m., there's a specialty Woo lunch that they're going to be offering as well. Uh, we're going to give everybody entered into win a $100 ticket. That's a ticket to this. And um, we also are going to give away the book. So everyone's getting entered into win Eating the Woo Way. It's for a longer, healthier, healthier life. You wrote the book, Stephen. Ag a cuff and along with these recipes and there's a ton of them in there we're going to talk a little bit about those too and our number here is 602-277-5369 and toll free it's 1-866-536-1100 uh, that's this weekend this seminar it's Tudor, at the Tudor Plaza in Phoenix and our, again we're entering everyone to win the $100 ticket our number here 602-277-5369 and toll free it's 1-866-536-1100 alright so what should we, have, we should avoid animal fat well no animal fats are okay it's the kind of animal fat but generally uh, having that as a secondary thing uh, good fats are coconut oil organic coconut oil olive oil we all know that olive oil is good and then the oil that's in seeds and nuts like pumpkin seeds uh, almonds you know hazelnuts so there's there are lots of, there's lots of good oil but a coconut oil is especially a health promoting oil so what would you recommend that our listeners do first to benefit from their food guidelines well i'd say first of all stay away from the nasties that's sugar don't eat sugar refined sugar is bad stay away from trans fats those are the most important things and then those things i just talked about to eat just try to go with that and you can look at my website stephenacuff.com to get the uh, the the guidelines again that's Stephen Acoff, and that's spelled A C U. 
WFF. And we've got our lines open here at 602-277-5369. Call in for the book. It's Eating the Woo Way for a Longer, Healthier Life. And also a ticket to the seminar that's this weekend. Our number here again, 602-277. Brown O'Haver.